I logged in my router and apparently someone beat me to it because um, because they had WEP enabled and they wouldn't let me um, filter MAC addresses and um, I think that's because I warned them. That's rule number one about security. Don't go on the internet and be like, hey, this is the security I'm about to do. But um, I did block U UPnP and it's I, I was worried that it was gonna it was gonna mess up my my internet because my I have a lot of because I'm using a lot of smart TV type stuff and what I found out is that you can still block UPnP and your smart TV will still work so that was good but that's because I don't play games if you have a kid that plays like has like a Xbox on the internet probably won't work if you disable UPnP um, but. For someone that doesn't play video games, I feel like you can disable UPnP. So that's a good thing. Um, found out you can't block VPN at the firewall on my computer, um, but that's fine because I don't really care. Uh, but it, there's a bunch of different firewall settings, like you can block ICMP. Um, so like I set the, my firewall setting to the strictest, and what I found out is that my internet still works, everything still works. But what's the rule about how to fix your computer if um, you block things at the router and your internet is messing up? Like, if your router keeps breaking, if your internet keeps shutting down after you try to change the security settings and you're like, why is, is my router not working now that I uh, set up the firewall at the router worse um, uh, or more intense? Um, what, what, what you would do is go change it back. So you go, okay, what's the most likely problem that I caused? Oh, I decided I wasn't going to cause fragment, or I wasn't going to allow fragmented packets through. Well, that might be a really bad decision. So um, sometimes you have to change things back. So my network's different than your network, but in general, what happens is you set the security settings more serious, and then if something's going wrong on your network, go log back into the router and change it back. So that's my, my advice. If you listen to me and I give you bad advice, like um, block UPnP and like, it's like, well, why is my router shutting down? Well, like probably there are a bunch of things at the buffer that are clogging it up. Someone's always trying to do UPnP and it's not working. Um, but I don't really know if that would, that would mess up your, if it would shut down your router. But if your router starts crashing or your internet starts breaking suddenly, it's it's your fault because you messed up things at the router and you need to go log in and fix it. So I thought about it and I do know about computers. I do. Um, but I, I don't know if they really would en enable WEP at the router in order to make it because like what happens, you, you break my internet and then you log into my router. Yeah, that's you get into my internet once, then you log into my router and then you enable WEP and then you can get me over Wi-Fi because you don't want to have to break WPA2. That makes sense. Um, so, um, yeah, you want to have WEP disabled at the router. Yeah. I, like, logging into a router is not that hard. So, no matter what, even if you're not a computer person, just go log into your router anyways. And, like, if you don't play video games and stuff, set up the firewall settings basic. Don't, like, or set it up the hardest. And then see if your internet breaks. And then if, it, if your internet stops working, switch it back. Just change the settings back and that's how to be a security person is um, try it and if it if it doesn't mess up you're good but um, it is better to do MAC address filtering which is saying on, only these these computers are allowed on my network and how do you do that make sure that all the computers in the room are connected to the internet and your router will detect them automatically and then add them to your list it's called an access control list and add them to your list of, of computers that are allowed on your network. That's pretty much how I do it.